Back at the waterfall, the resident frogs are still giving Steve the slip. Yeah, little. As a kid, I spent many summers making plans for how I was going to catch this animal or that animal, and I get to do the same thing now. These little frogs are pretty quick, so I'm going to construct a net, see if that'll help us out. <laughs> Frogmaster! See, what we should have done was brought a proper net, but that's kind of the easy way out. If you look close, you see the expanded toes, so they have the ability to stick to the rock like a tree frog. And then finally what they do after bing, 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 they escape by jumping into the rushing water in the waterfall. And, and that's how this little frog makes its living. Justine's staking out a tree full of ripe figs. It should be a magnet for orangutans. But for some reason, they're staying well away. I kind of thought I was going to see an orang straight away, which I know is completely unrealistic, but um, I thought seeing as it's got so many fruits on it, this tree, that I'm bound to see loads of stuff. So this is my view out from the platform. And as you can see, it's a very long way down. The rainforest birds are drawn to the ripe fruit, including the spectacular rhinoceros hornbill. It was brilliant. Their huge beaks can pluck the figs from the tree with enormous precision. But Justine has noticed these birds on the canyon edge are acting strangely. The hornbills have been so surprisingly nervous. Even though I've got all this, this hide stuff up, they've noticed something strange and then carried on. But one or two that have landed have just taken straight off again. Justine treks further out of the canyon to find a better place to film. And there she makes a grim discovery. This is a trap or a snare for, a, um, for an animal that hunters are setting. And uh, there's a little gate here, almost, a little pa passageway. And, um, and then they fence the area, so there's an obvious route through. And then as the animal comes through, there's a, there'll be a noose here, because it's a diminishing area, so... You know, if you do want to hunt, there's, there's, there's quite small patches really left to hunt in because all the rest of it's been turned into oil palm plantations, which have got nothing but rats and snakes in them by all accounts. The hunters have penetrated further than anyone thought. It scuppered the chances of Justine filming these nervous orangutans. 